Ah. Oh. Love a good sip of Malort in the morning. You don't need much, just a tiny taste. Oh. Hey everybody, welcome to the third part of Paul, uh, Pike May's unboxing. Old, oldies.com box of stuff unboxing video. I am Pike Mays. I thank you for being here for the climactic conclusion. And let's just jump right into it because I'm telling you, we got a lot to get to. We got a lot to get to. So right off the, just right off the bat, look at that. Secrets and Lies. The thriller movies. T 10 thriller movies. So let me get, let me get my little scissors out here that I use to trim my nose hair and I will show you this the theme the theme of the last uh video here is all of these are going to be compilation you know like a bunch of movies on a, on on several DVDs and so up first here is is Secrets and Lies. It is 10 thriller movies. Uh, just kind of show you the front there in case you want to pause that and look at all the covers, you know, because there's a lot, there's a lot going on here. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you the back. And then I'm going to read the movies to you. But if you want to read the descriptions of the movies, you can pause it right here. Okay. So listen to this. We got Mara... Merrily Players, what does that mean? Like a Christmas? Better not be a Christmas movie. Merrily? Merrily Players. Uh, something called Cold Heart Canyon. Uh, Heartlines. Uh, Wedding Day. The Saints of Mount Christopher. That sounds like a good one. A Numbers Game. S uh, Surrender. Barracuda, Shattered, and Abandoned Souls. I might have Abandoned Souls already. I'm not sure. No, it doesn't look like it. Man, there, there's some great looking stuff on here though, right? Look at that. I'm so excited about this. And okay, all right. We got a, a flimsy DVD case. Last time on the show, we had some strong DVD cases, but this time they're flimsy. And But the, these are on two discs, so you get five movies per disc. So these are going to look like dog shit. But that's okay, you know, you get what you pay for on oldies.com. So there's Secrets and Lies. That's uh, the first set of movies. Ten movies. I mean, right off the bat, we've already had more movies in this part three than we did in the whole entirety of part one and part two. And that's no offense to any of those movies, but there's a lot of shit going on here. But we are not even close to being done here. We are not even close, folks. I am so freaking excited about this. I do have a neck injury, so please uh, send some well wishes in the comments below that the surgery goes well next month for the neck. Sorry, having a little trouble getting, you know, I just want to, I want you to have as little glare as possible. Let me just get a quick sip of this too and we're good to go so i got an eight film horror collection here check that out yeah it's eight movies it's not 10 but we got some bangers on here are you kidding me do you see this are you seeing this right now let's go through it real, real quick we got well here i'll let you look at that and then i'll show you the back yeah yeah, uh, man, this might, this might be it right here. This might be what I watched tonight. We have so many bangers on here. We got Shallow Ground. We got Severed. We got Evil Remains. We got Gone Dark. 
Spliced, Blood Gnome, the classic Julie Strain uh, movie from 2000, Blood Gnome, The Demon Within, and Hell's Gate, 1111. Like the time. Yeah, like time. Like, like it's 11, 11 p.m. or something. I don't know. Crazy. Just absolutely crazy. Now, I do own Severed. I think it's called Severed Forest of the Dead. Yeah, Severed Forest of the Dead. I do own that. It's got Paul Campbell from Battlestar Galactica. Shout out to Paul. Two people named Paul. Well, not me. I'm Pike Mays. But there are more than one p person named Paul. And Paul Campbell's one of them. So here's uh, this great collection. I do have a thing on the top. Should I take it off? Comment down below if you think I should take this off. If you said yes, you were right, because I'm taking it off. The, this, not clothes or anything. It's just a little joke. Got that. Oh, you want ASMR? It's cold and it's cold out here. You know, I'm out here on the street. Streets of Chicago doing this unboxing video. Oh, sorry, ASMR. But that's why I have the coat on. All right, we're cracking this open. Here's some ASMR for you. Wow, look at this. You got one DVD, two DVD. Three DVD, four DVD. It's like Sesame Street on here. Four DVDs, eight movies, so two movies per disc. That's not too bad. These might look okay. I will let you know. I'm really looking forward to some of these, especially Evil Remains. I've been trying to find this Evil Remains for a while now. So there's that. And we are still going, folks. It's, I know it's hard to believe, but we are still going. All right, up next, I'll show you the cover first and then I'll get it open up. We got six movies featuring crazed killers. All right, now I don't know if uh, uh, Jeffrey Dahmer is on this one or not. He was on, if you remember, he was on part one. He was on part one, but I don't know if he's in this collection or not. I, we will get into it, though. Don't worry. I'll show you. Having, having trouble. Having trouble. Got my scissors. My nose hair. Ready? Use the plastic. All right, uh, crazed, oh, earthquake or something. Crazed Killers, six movies. All right, you see what's on there? You can pause it if you want to. Let's look at the back. Oh, boy, that's a lot of killing. That's a lot of crazed killing. And what we got here, I'll just read it, okay? Here, did you get everything? Can you see all that? Pause it if you want to. Toe Tags, Day of the Axe, Kill the Scream Queen, The Traveler, Charlie's Death Wish, and a movie called Serial Killer, okay? Now, Toe Tags is 2003, Day of the Axe, 2005, Scream, Kill the Scream Queen, 2004, the Traveler 2005, wow, Charlie's Death Wish 2005, and Serial Killer 2004. So, like, if you're into mid-2000s horror, this is going to be your jam right here. Crazed Killers. And uh, this is put out by a company called Pendulum Pictures, and it's exclusively distributed by Mill Creek Entertainment. So this is just wild. There is a thing on top here. I'm not going to take it off. This one I'm not going to take off. If you commented below and you said don't take the top 
thing off of the Craze Killers, you got it right. So congratulations. I gotta show spines. I forgot to show spines again. You guys gotta keep me on my toes. Spines. Okay. Folks, we got one... We got one DVD left. Are you ready for it? Here we go. I'm going to get the plastic off first. There's no thing on the top, so we can open it right up with no issue whatsoever. And it is going to be just an epic, epic climax to this unboxing series. There it is. It's The plastic is off. And what we have here are 20 horror movies on DVD. It's a great value, it says right there, and I agree. Because you get on oldies.com, this stuff is, guys, it's like four bucks for each of these. I mean, I think for Daisy Durkins, I spent like six bucks, but some of these were like $2.99, you know, $3.99. Like, I'm not out here spending you know, hundreds and hundreds of dollars on this stuff. I'm going to open it up. Let, let's get a quick look at the back first. TC, or not TC, um, CT. That was my cat, CT, for Crush. Crusher, uh, skull, uh, tiny, cat, cat, cat tiny. So here is 20 horror movies on DVD. Uh, let's go through these, okay? Bay Coven. Live from Death Row. Nightmare at Bitter Creek. A lure, a lure, like a fishing lure, a lure, Teen Fight Club. Dire Wolf. Hurt. It's just called Hurt. I don't know if that's a Nine Inch Nails thing or what. Um, the Cellar Door. Breadcrumbs. That doesn't sound very scary. The Shadows. That does sound scary. I don't, I don't like shadows. Night Drive. That could be scary. You like you driving at night. Uh, Home for the Holidays. Can't watch that. Can't watch that right now. Can't watch that for almost a year. Like 11 months, I got 11 months to go until I can even watch that movie if it's truly set during the holidays. And I'm not even going to take my chances with it. No, what does it say? No one could protect her. That's too bad. Murder So Sweet. Ugh. Winter of Frozen Dreams. Well, winter is usually cold. It's cold right now here in Chicago. That's why I got this coat on. Uh, here we have something called Midnight's Child, and then, uh, The Cry. That's, you know, it's nice to have a good cry every now and then. Smackle, sh Shackled. <laughs> Smackled would be a good title, though. Shackled is the name of this movie on this DVD for this unboxing. Ominous, it's a good title. Uh, Another Kind of What? Another Kind of What? See, I'm intrigued by that. Another kind of creature? What? And then the last one on the list here is called The Lonely Ones. So, so many different freaking movies on here. 20, in fact, movies. And then I'm going to open it up here. Okay, so you have a bunch of DVDs. Looks like three or four just stacked inside here like a bunch of assholes. And then over here, you have a description of all of the movies, which is pretty cool. You can go in and, I mean, look at that. Look how small the print is. You can go in there and just be like, I want to know who the gaffer was on breadcrumbs. And if you have a magnifying glass, you can find out. So that is super cool. So many...
Oh, my crown fell off. Did you guys notice my crown? Pretty cool. Because these unboxing videos, these movies that, are, that I'm unboxing are fit for a king, I have to say. So there you go. There is a... 20 horror movies and then we'll pair it up here with all of this stuff right here I'll just be like something like this you know for the thumbnail and uh, just loving these movies you know just loving all these DVDs from oldies.com We've got a catalog in here for some men's clothing, too. We've got all sorts of stuff in here. Hey, hold on, we got some bonus. This is like a post-credits end, you know, special scene. Look at this! we got a Budweiser Holiday Express train. You could get that for Christmas, but don't get it right now in January or February or whenever this is coming out. Whoa, look at this. Incredible Hulk figure and then what is this wow elvis presley outdoor uh, sign address sign you can pretend that elvis lives at your house how cool how freaking cool is that it's from the bradford exchange in Morton Grove, Illinois. I might just go up there and see if I can tour the facility. Anyway, I thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed all of these movies that I have un unboxed. Obviously, I'll be back for more, but I don't know when. I have to get the next surgery. And they say that I might be out of commission from, they said anywhere from two weeks to, um, I think they said like three and a half years or something like that. So I don't know. It's nice that I have all these movies that I can, you know, watch while I'm recuperating from the neck surgery. So I do thank you for watching. I hope everyone out there is doing well until and, and until and, and until I recover from my neck surgery. This is Pike Mays saying all these movies don't have to just be for old people. It can be for anyone watching who wants to watch some great movies on DVD. Thank you.